And here he is, Jordan Farmar, big night tonight, and you responded well to the crowd. You knew this was a huge game, and you let everybody know you were going to take care of business. First minute or two of the game, you were on fire. Definitely. I mean, I just came out looking to be aggressive, make some things happen, and uh, feed off the energy that our crowd was providing. Uh, as you mentioned, Jordan, your your ankle may be bothering you, but it went to some degree, uh, but you don't care. I mean, you're out there as a competitor. You've told us that several times that you will do whatever it takes to win and lead this team to victory. Definitely. I mean, it's getting better from day to day, and that's a positive sign. I'm really excited about that. But uh, even if it is bothering me, if my teammates and my coach want me out there, I'm going to do my, the best of my ability to help us in any way I can. Almost pretty much as you were a person who wanted to learn about the game of basketball and you saw this game tonight, they would say, who is number one? Because he played the complete game, scoring, assisting, rebounding. And you got to be very proud of your effort tonight. Definitely. Uh, coach has been making a strict emphasis on playing defense and rebounding. And uh, naturally, I gave other people the ball. So if I'm looking to be aggressive, doing what I do naturally, and then keeping the emphasis on defensive rebounding, that just makes me a complete player. Uh, there's got to be a new description for the Bruins because they're young, young at heart, but they're veteran with their time on the court. And man, this team here is, uh, you would think, oh, juniors and seniors out there, but that's not the case. Sophomores and freshmen. Definitely, and that just shows the promise of the future. I mean, we have a lot of a lot of young talent, and we're excited to, to go forward every day. So mm -hmm. we're looking forward to the rest of this year, and then coming back stronger even next year and the year after that. So we have some firepower for the future. And, and they had to be pleased. Now, even though with all the rash of injuries uh, through the season, it seems like the guys that are able to come back, as they say, the troops are ready to come back fighting. Here comes Ryan Hollins and has a big game. Definitely. I mean, that's that's what we've been showing all year is our character. Mm -hmm. um, whenever someone goes down, someone else steps up in their place. And then when uh, whenever we get healthy, we come back right where we left off. So, I mean, that just shows our toughness and our character that we have in this program. Okay, Jordy, what's up next? Another big one. There's really no let up for the Bruins. You can't rest on laurels because you play a big game and then here comes another one. Definitely. I mean, at this level, being at a place like UCLA, there is no, no let up, no time for a rest. Um, mm -hmm. That's how we want it to be. I mean, you want to go out of your college career thinking that you played the best and you did the best of your ability. So mm -hmm. West Virginia is the hottest team in the country, in my opinion, right now on a 12-game winning streak with yes. wins at Villanova, who's mm -hmm. in the top five. So mm -hmm. they can get it done, and we'll, we'll really be tested on Saturday. And again, uh, everyone knows that well, West Virginia story last year, they had a Cinderella season, and, and here they are back again, pounding at the door. But again, Coach Howland's got to be, again, kind of calculating down the road, using uh, the players to their best ability. Uh, but it, we'll see um, uh, Richard uh, went down a little bit tonight with the uh, with, tripped up uh, in that play, but he's going to be okay? He's going to be fine. Okay. He's one of the toughest kids we have. Uh, just got kicked in the shin. It's okay. painful, but he'll be fine. Okay. Jordan Farmer, former Taft High School standout All-American, and, and of course, as everyone knows, uh, uh, throughout his high school career, but now leading the pack, leading, as we want to say, our, our Bruins on to victory and on and again into the postseason. So, Jordy, we'll see you down the road just in a couple of more days. All right. Thank okay. you. Thank All right. Okay.